All right, making a video of tire scraping. As you know, kid carts like to have the ability to pick up a lot of rubber because they don't really be, build any heat. Um, if you look, sometimes they do. Sometimes they really don't get a lot of rubber on there. Um, especially like this top, front left one, sorry, pointing at the top. Um, for the most part, this really isn't that bad until you actually scrape it. So what I'm gonna do, try to position the camera a little bit better on something and give you an example of how I scrape these tires because I've seen people essentially heat them up, go across, well that usually, they'll use a scraper and go straight across and then it leaves the tire with, you know, 50, 60 flat spots all the way around. It's never smooth. So we're going to do it my way. Um, I've shared this with a few people in the club, but uh, what I'm going to do is attempt to show you how I'm doing it with the heat gun. So here we go. Just basically going to get it warm enough. Start scraping it as I turn the tire. Now the trick is just to keep moving. And maybe only go about a fifth of the way around. <coughs> and as you see, I can kind of take and fling the end out. And basically, the rubber just falls right out of this this end, which is made kind of like a compressed diffuser. Eventually this will work its way into the shape of the tire, which makes it even better. Uh, but as you can see, the more I go, fling it out, the better it is. And you can just keep working away around the tire. Fling it out. That's pretty much it. And what you end up with is a result, for the most part, like this. Instead of having cross sections going this way and pretty much I can get these down for the most part I can usually find the original bead around the center line that's pretty much it <laughs> 